We are students from Modern Mobile Branch of Dayanand Sagar College of Engineering. I am Manish. I am Suresh. I am Vijay. And we are here to perform LVTT experiment of mechanical measurements and metrology laboratory. So let's start. This is the LVDT. It stands for Linear Variable Differential Transducer. What is it used for? This is used for converting the mechanical motion into electrical signals. Through the micrometer, we can change the dis uh, displacement of the coil and through the connection of a digital display unit, we can measure the displacement in the electrical form. The difference in this gives the error percentage. This is the equipment of our experiment. This is the linear variable differential transducer. It works on principle of a mutual induction which consists of two secondary coils and one primary coil. It is a hollow cylinder which has a iron, soft iron core inside this which can be moved through the micrometer over here. The micrometer mo movement can also be displayed in the digital display unit. So we can switch on this digital display unit by connecting the respective color of this wire. Let's connect this. Okay. By powering on, we can find the the moment in uh, soft iron core in the hollow cylinder gives rise to change in flux, which uh, in turn gives rise to mutual induction. The mutual induction is the principle by which the LVDT works. Before starting the experiment, we have to calculate the LVDT device. So to calibrate the LVDT device, we have to check the null point over here. So now the micrometer is at null point over here, which means none. So now I'll displace the micrometer towards the negative side over here. So two rotations equals to one mm over here. Now the digital displacement unit shows minus uh, 1 mm over here, which means there is no over uh, error over here. So now let's start to take the readings over here. This is RS. RS is the mechanical displacement over here in the micrometer, which I have displaced for 1 mm over here. And now RA is the digital displacement unit, which means the readings over here. Now to calculate the percentage error, this is the formula RS minus RA by RA into 100. So this gives the percentage of error. So now let's start to take the readings over here, which is now the micrometer is at null point. The rotation over here gives po uh, 0.5 mm. A rotation gives 0.5 mm over here. So two rotations give 1 mm distance over here. After rotating for two rotations, the displacement over here shows 1 mm, which means that there is no uh, difference over here. Finally, these are the negative side readings, that is the left side of the null point. So the percentage error can be calculated by the formula RS minus RA by RA into 100. So this is the first reading that we have took and uh, the percentage error equals to 0. So finally, from the readings that has been tabulated, we can tell the percentage error of the LVDT machine and uh, these are our results.